So I've been talking to uh, Red, uh, Red to the Head. Go and check out his channel if you haven't already. Um, uh, I kind of told him I'd do this video last night, but I just couldn't do it. As simple as that. Um, but he said about it again today, so here we are. Um, hopefully we can get through it. And yeah, I'm not really sure the purpose of the video yet. Um, where do we start? I mean, I guess growing up, I uh, spent my whole life basically in education, um, being taught what to think and not how to think. Um, to me, that wasn't right. You know, um, this is you know this is something that's sort of led me to sort of question everything um, around me, uh, the way things worked, uh, everything like that. You know, society as a whole. Um, this doesn't really go down well with most people, as you can imagine. Um, but there you go. Uh, I guess before we go any further, I'll address the, the elephant in the room. Um, I'm from the UK, so obviously here, smoking weed's illegal. Um, so I wouldn't be doing anything like that on camera. Um, but be assured, I am a member of this community and a big supporter of which, you know. So. Um, yeah, so that's about out of the way, basically. Um, I reckon I'm probably going to have to cut this video off a bit and, you know, sort of spice about together at the end and work out what I'm doing. Because um, I don't really know what I'm doing. Um, it's my first proper sit here and talk video, so we'll see how it goes. Um, yeah. I realise it may not be for everybody, so uh, if you don't like what's going on here, uh, feel free to move along. There's plenty of other people to watch videos, and there's loads of great YouTubers out there. So um, I'm just here uh, making a video. Getting back to uh, what's been going on in life um, for the last six years. I've been working full time. Um, been with my girlfriend Emma. Um, you get into a routine, you kind of do the same thing day in, day out. You know, we don't do an awful lot. We try and get out on the weekend if we can. Um, but we're usually busy because we're so busy in the week, you know, you know what it's like. Um, so it gives you a lot of time to think, a lot of time to think about things. And, I guess I'll lead you, I'm not going to start with conspiracy theories or anything like that, but I mean, it just, it just leads you to sort of realise a lot of things going on around you, it's not quite right. Um, whether it be the fact that, you know, I don't know the next door neighbours either side of me, um, they probably don't want to know me either and that's fine. Um, but that's kind of the way it's going in the world today and uh, that's, you know, I've uh, I've sort of drifted away from a lot of friends over the years and, you know, I sort of, sort of live in our own little bubble and uh, you know, blunder on working like you do and just trying to get shit done. Um, but that's what sort of led me to YouTube in a way. Um, I don't really watch television because, you know, I don't, watch, I don't like to watch mainstream news, anything like that. Um, uh, it's nothing on telly for me, do you know what I mean? Um, YouTube's been something we've watched for years. I mean, we don't even have a telly connected in this room. We've got one attached to a DVD player and that's it. Uh, um, yeah, I never realised until recently that YouTube could be such... Uh, you know, I never say YouTube's a community, but I never like really realised it. Um, I signed up, just started posting some videos of me doing me... Um, building a truck that I'm building at the moment and just some of the stuff we get up to work and stuff like that but I've never really sat here and talked to the camera at all but um you know so recently I've been watching a lot of videos and naturally you gravitate, gravitate towards you know people that have got similar interest in you and make you know videos that you'd be interested in um and uh through this I've actually Started to meet some 
really amazing like-minded people which is uh, a pretty good thing when you start to think about it because in your immediate surroundings you may not necessarily have people with the same perception as you on whatever it may be um, I find it a lot easier to talk to certain people than others who you go to, and that's you know, the way things work. You know. um, but like I said, this community that's building on YouTube at the moment is uh, it's astonishing, really, um, especially in this day and age where people just don't communicate and aren't interested. And, you know, they're, they're surrounded by social media and live life sometimes on the phone and whatever else, you know, people don't have time for people anymore, um, but on um, here, people have been taking the time, um, and making the effort, um, as far as I'm concerned, that's, a, that's amazing, you know, where else are you going to find this, I've never seen it anywhere, um, no community in real life, but community on YouTube, that's, I never thought technology could do something like that, but here we are, um, as Red said, building this arm. I've never really been a particularly sociable person. Um, to the point where I avoid social gatherings, anything like that, you know, anything to do with family, anything like that, definitely avoid that sort of thing. Um, I still don't know why. I never used to be like it. It was when I spent a year at university, come back, and then that's when it sort of happened. But regardless of the point, you know, I'm sat here doing the same thing day in, day out. And I start using this YouTube thing. And people start connecting with you, whether it be through you commenting or them commenting to you or watching your videos or liking your videos or and you know it's not just that there's like real human connections going on like with people you know from all over the world um with a common theme you know um you know the kind of green is important in my, most of my life you know simple as that um and it has been in my uh, life a lot longer than it should have been probably, but um, there you go. Uh, yeah, like I said, I've met some amazing people on my own, and every way you look, every which way you look, I should be fighting more every minute. I mean, I've been watching a lot of mud flapping Tim recently, and it was through Tim I found the scavenger hunt, through Tim I found Red, and through Red I found you know, Fester Jester, some other, you know, simple lungs, simple lungs, simple high, puffing lungs, you know, uh, I already knew about Judah, um, I hope I haven't missed anybody, I don't know, um, but yeah, some also, truly awesome people out there, you know, genuinely trying to get shit done, um, uh, trying to change things, and I mean, that's really important to me, because, Things don't work right. And I'm not going to sit here and preach on about every little aspect that I don't think is right. But as a general rule of thumb, a lot of things aren't as they should be. Um, money, power, probably big factors in this. Uh, it's not my place to call it. Um, not all I can do about the world as such but if I can be a part of this movement and we can do something one small thing to change everything then I'm really proud to be a part of it and I'll do everything we can you know um, I apologise for the length of this video it's probably going to be me rambling terribly uh, I don't know why I still feel really awkward to talk to the camera
going to take a bit of practice, let's put it that way. But um, I'd like to thank everybody who has supported me along the way. Um, I'd like to thank Red for actually kicking my ass to get me to go and make a video, a uh, proper video. Um, so, yeah. Um, check this on the computer, see what it's like, and uh, hope you enjoy it. Please comment below, let me know what you think. Tell me to shut up. Anything, anything's good, you know. Um, yeah, cheers guys, and uh, hope we catch you again soon.